Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey what's up? My name is Caitlin and today we're doing my BoxyCharm Premium Unboxing. I am super pumped for this because this month is a Norvina X ABH Anastasia Beverly Hills um, takeover. They did this a while back with Fenty where like everything in the box was Fenty products. So this time it is everything in here is Anastasia Beverly Hills or Norvina. And I am pumped because I really like that brand and I'm excited and everything's cruelty free. And I don't have to guess if it's cruelty free because I know ABH is. Um, but I already see some like little purple stuff coming out of here. Um, this one retails for $35 a month. You can get this one as well as the mini box or one or the other. I do both obviously, but um, you can do one or, one or the other. You don't have to do both. But here is this box. So let's go ahead and open this up. And ta-da! It says BoxyCharm X Norvina Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's got some purple and some butterflies and it's cute. Butterflies always make me think of my grandma. Uh, she has a butterfly obsession. So every time I see butterflies, I think of her. Fun fact, if you wanted to know. But here is the car right here. Products on this side. Um, I did see people talk about this in their video, so I will mention it in mine as well. Uh, they do have a coupon on here. Buy one, get one 50% off at Anastasia's website. Uh, it's use code ABHXBOXY right there. If you want to use that, you can. Okay, the first thing I see on top, I'm gonna wait for the last thing to show you because it's probably the most exciting product in here. So we're just gonna move that aside. And then we got some bubble wrap underneath. Mm, okay, I'm a little bit bummed because there was one product I really wanted, which was the setting spray. I did not get that, but that's okay. So first thing I see in here is this guy. This is the Brow Definer, Triangular Brow Pencil. We have the shade Medium Brown. We'll, we'll see if that works for me. Let's look at this. I don't know, is the Brow Definer the really popular one? I can never remember. I think so, the triangular one. Um, I think that'll work for me. Yeah, I think we can make that work. Uh, but yeah, the ABH brow pencils are super popular. I think it's the brow definer that's popular. This one retails for $23. Next thing in here we got is this little eyeshadow brush. Okay, um, this retails for $16. Okay, this I'm not excited about. Like, I feel like they could have definitely thrown something else in here besides this little little tiny brush. That's okay, I guess. I mean, the Anastasia brow, these are like what you get with the palettes for free. So the fact that they're like charging you $16 for those, don't love that. Okay, that's okay. Can't love everything, right? Next thing is the loose highlighter in the shade Vegas. This retails for $25. Um, I know these are showing up at TJ Maxx and Marshalls like a lot, so probably not worth the $25 price tag, but still this packaging is gorgeous. I didn't want these when they came out. Um, I just didn't buy them because they were pricey. I mean, they're $25 each and then um, they uh, I don't use loose highlighters super often, so I feel like I was going to be wasteful if I bought them, but I did want them, so I'm happy I have one now and didn't have to pay $25 for it. Okay, I'm doing serious. I want to swatch this for you, but this little guy's in the way. Okay, I'm out of there. <gasps> okay, well, <laughs> I popped the whole thing off. Um, I don't know how that didn't go everywhere, but it kind of did, but not really. I'm just gonna like take a little bit of this and just put that back in there. We're gonna pretend like that didn't happen. <laughs> oh wow, I grabbed way a lot. That's probably gonna be too dark for me, isn't it? Oh, it's so pretty though. Ooh, if you had like a deeper, like chocolate skin tone, you put that all over your body, that'd be gorgeous. Um, well, that is a little dark for me, but I will try to make it work. We'll see what happens. 
Um, yeah, it's all over me now. That nail, we're just, yeah, we're just gonna do that. <laughs> um, next thing in here, felt a little bit dirty from the uh, highlighter, but this is the loose setting powder from the shade translucent. Holy Toledo, that is a ginormous thing. That is not gonna fit in my setting powder section. <laughs> I love setting powder stuff. Uh, like, my setting powders all go in one of these, and it's, I don't think that's gonna fit in there. Maybe, maybe, we'll try. That's huge. I'm obviously not gonna swatch this because it's just a transition powder, but still exciting nonetheless. Last thing in the box, oh, the setting powder retails for $38. So just this pays for the box plus shipping, and the rest is like free. Um, next is an Anastasia, obviously, <laughs> liquid lipstick in the shade Malt. I have tried their liquid lips. I do like them quite a bit. Ooh, it's like a chocolatey brown color. I don't know that I love the color, but ooh, yeah. Eh, not my cup of tea color-wise, but you know, it's always good to have something like this to step out of your comfort zone. Um, that retails for $20. The liquid lips are also quite often at um, TJ Maxx and Marshalls, so I kind of sensing a theme here, but that's okay, I guess. Um, next thing in here and last thing in here is this. This is the ABH Marvina Volume 3 Pro Pigment Palette. I do not have any of these. I've wanted all of them, but I have not purchased them because they're $60 each. Um, I need my little makeup wipe to get rid of this mess that I've got going on here on my hand. Okay. So this one, I don't remember if I picked the eyeshadow palette because like you got an option between this and the volume two, I believe the purple one. I don't remember if I chose because looking at it, I was like, I don't know. I want them both, so I don't know if I made the choice or not. Is that going to stay there or is it going to fall? It's definitely going to fall. Come on. Stay. Okay. <laughs> I'm having difficulties. But opening it up, looks like this. Nice little black box in here. Uh, okay. This is so pretty. I love this outer packaging. It's very sturdy. It's like a hard plastic. And then... So pretty. A lot of mattes in here, but here are the colors. So pretty. I love this color story. It's very like vibrant, but also like some wearable shades. That C2 shade is frightening me. It's like a bright red. I the only complaint I have right off the bat is I do not like the way they name them. So like A1, A2, A3, B1, C like boring. <laughs> Pretty boring. Makes me feel like I'm playing Battleship, but very pretty though. So let's go ahead and swatch. I don't know if this is the same formula as her smaller palettes are, but I do really like that. I'm definitely swatching C2 because it's frightening. It's like a fire truck red. Ooh, okay. Um, let's do B1, which is a metallic icy blue shade. That's pretty. I really like this A4 color like a neon yellowy green. Ooh, pretty. Um, and let's do E3, which is like a melony orange coral color. Pretty. I really like this color story. These retail for $60. I think I said that already, but we're going to tell you again just in case I didn't. Um, but yeah, definitely by far my favorite thing in the box is this palette, which I think is probably everyone's favorite. Um, but yeah, quick recap, pumped about the palette, like super pumped. Okay. The setting powder I'm excited about, like, I mean, it's setting powder, so it's not like the most exciting makeup product to get, but I'm always down for a new setting powder. The liquid lip, I love these liquid lips. I just don't really like the color I got, but you know, maybe we'll use it. We'll try it out. I can always mix like a lighter shade with it too. Um, the highlight, I really wanted these, so I'm excited I have it now. I just wish I would have got a lighter color. 
The brow definer I'm super excited about because like, I don't know, everyone raves about this. I've never tried it before. This is the only product that I'm like really about, which is the dual ended eyeshadow brush. Just because you literally get this brush for free in her palettes. I'm pretty sure. Now that I'm saying that, I'm like, do you? I don't know, maybe I'm crazy, but I'm pretty sure you get these in her palette. So I think I had like a bunch of them and I got rid of them, but you know, it is what it is. Like it's an eyeshadow brush, I'll use it. But that's everything. Let me know down below if you guys got this box, what you got, so I can be jealous if you got stunning spray. Um, but yeah, that's everything. Don't forget to like this video before you go. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any more of my future videos. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.